Welcome to self study tutorials. In this video tutorial, we will discuss introduction to QGIS plus FELT API. We will discuss how to download and use FELT API in QGIS. We will discuss how to bring QGIS data to FELT online with practical example. QGIS is one of the popular desktop based GIS software. It enables users to create, edit, visualize, and publish geospatial data. FELT is an online GIS tool which is very easy to use and allows us to create and share maps. Combination of FELT API and QGIS makes data sharing very easy and fast. Let's see an example how this combo works together. During demonstration of QGIS desktop to felt online, I will be using following resources. Number one, I have downloaded QGIS software from download.qgis.org site. Number two, I have created my account under felt.com website. Number three, I have downloaded felt QGIS plugin from plugins.qgis.org website. Download latest plugin so this is felt plugin we will get zip file and finally i have downloaded india outline map in tiff file format which is special type of file format for gis based applications so this is india outline map tiff file start your qgis software first of all we will install qgis felt plugin in this software for that, go to your plugins menu under QGIS and then install plugins. While installing plugins, we have some options available. So we have already downloaded zip file. So we will select our zip file, which is downloaded under my system. So let's open this zip file and just install your plugin. This is security warning. Make sure you have downloaded your plugins from right platform. Click yes to continue. This will install your felt plugin in your system. Plugin installed successfully message received. Let's close this window now. And you can see one icon related to felt plugin is added into our QGIS software. I'm creating new project. In this project, First of all, I will create one raster layer. In that raster layer, I will import this India outline map. And then on this map, I will create one vector layer to show various offices located in India. So let's begin our first task. Let's add one raster layer. Select your file. Add this India outline map and you can see one layer is created under QGIS. Now we will create one more layer which is a vector category of layer and in that vector layer we will add points. Points to show various offices located in India. So for that go to this layer again. Let's create one shape layer. We will give name offices in India and select geometric type as point because we want to save points. Let's give variable name as city name. Add this field. Now we have two fields here. One ID, second one is city name. Just click OK. So you can see one more layer is added here called India offices in India. Now let's add some points here. So for that go to this pencil button and add some points. So let's add point number one and add data related to this point one Ahmedabad office. So one point is added in this vector layer. Let's add one more office here. City ID two New Delhi. Similarly third point somewhere here. City ID three. Bombay region office. 
So you can see now we have two layers created. One is vector and the second one is a layer with points. Now we will export both these layer from this QGIS desktop system to this felt online tool so that we can use both this layer information in felt. After creating points, make sure to save this layer edits. So save layer edits. Now data is saved. Click on this felt API icon. We have to log in this felt online once. A browser will be opened where you can give your credentials. I am using my felt ID password. After providing ID and password, you will get this message. QGIS has been successfully authorized. This indicates that now we can export data from this QGIS software to felt online. We can give some appropriate name. This is QGIS Felt API Demo and date you can mention. Just click on Add to Felt. So this will upload our content from QGIS desktop software to Felt online. This will take some seconds depending on the size of your data. Upload complete. We can open this map now and you can see both the layers are now created under felt online. This will take some time depending on size of your data. Both the layers are now added to my felt account. This is vector layer containing points and this is raster layer containing that image of India map. And once we have both the layers which are added in felt, then it's very easy for us to use additional functionality. For example, let's add text label here. This is QGIS2 felt demo. And rest of the functionalities you are aware about, you can use these interesting functionalities to add various options as you want. You can also use advanced functionalities like uploading various file formats straightforward to your existing project on Felt Online. So using Felt API is very simple. One last action, just log out your APIs once you are done with all your tasks. So you can go to this option and log out your APIs from this QGIS project.